So we've added uh, uh, Maxi, Maximiliano Yuruti um, from Toronto FC, um, formerly uh, Newell's Old Boys. Um, excited about uh, the addition. You know, he's a player we, we, we've had on our radar for, for quite some time. Um, we've scouted him extensively. Um, he's, a, he's a player we liked. Um, he was a, he's a player that we couldn't get because Toronto had the discovery on him. Um, but uh, obviously when the opportunity um, presented itself to, to get him uh, through a trade, uh, we jumped on it. No, la verdad que... no the truth is uh, I didn't know anything about this. Uh, I was on the bench on Saturday and right after the game is when they told me what they were uh, thinking about doing. And I guess that's how things work here. But uh, I'm really excited to be here. I had the opportunity to talk to Diego Valery and he took me to his house and we talked. And so I'm just happy to be here now. You have to have multiple options in the striker position. And I like to have different dimensions in those options. Um, if you have four of the same guys, then you know you, it doesn't give you as much flexibility depending on the game and what you need. Um, ultimately, the players have to be able to play in that center striker role in our system. Um, and what we're looking for is very specific. Uh, but within that, we like different dimensions. And uh, we feel like he brings a different dimension than what, than what we had, which will complement uh, our, our, our depth, um, give us multiple options. Um, you know, Freddie's good in the air. Ryan Johnson's uh, strong, has power uh, to his game. Um, you know, Jose has, has pace and, and skill and 1v1 ability. And uh, we feel like Yuruti has uh, tactical awareness, very clever in his movement. Uh, he's also very technical and um, really a smart player. He knows how to bring midfielders into the game. And, you know, he's a clinical finisher as well. And he's played at the highest level. Um, you know, in one of the top clubs in the world. Uh, he contributed to Newell's winning the championship in the Premier A. You know, he's been professional for a long time, and um, to make it uh, at the level he's made it, you have to be good around goal. And, um, you know, we've got a good group already. Uh, we've got good options already. Um, you know, but we've, we think he will definitely bring a, a different dimension, which will give us, again, uh, depth, multiple options, um, make my decisions a little bit tougher, uh, but that's a good thing. It's a good problem to have. For what I've seen is uh, uh, Coach Caleb likes to play the ball, which is uh, what we all like. And uh, it's something that I actually had the opportunity to learn with uh, uh, Coach uh, Martino at Newell's. Uh, he reinforced the, the uh, keeping the ball with us, with the team, and also when we lose the ball, we, ha we have to go and recover real fast, which is very, a very effective way of working on the field. And I think that's the style that, that Coach uh, Porter likes to play. And so we, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. I mean, we wanted to make a move that would help us now, but we, want, we wanted it to be a move that would also help us in the future. I mean, this guy's 22 years old, so obviously he helps us in the future. Um, but we also, we wanted to make a move that would help us now as well. And so, you know, when you start to check off those boxes, um, you know, it becomes a, an easy decision. I had the chance to see the game on Saturday and I know that Portland has a really good team and uh, we concluded that uh, Portland has a really great team they like to play the ball which is a style of game that we all like they want to fight for uh, important things this season so uh, we concluded that this is a great opportunity for, for me and uh, to be part of this uh, great team